Hello, welcome to how to solve this very nice algebra equation x squared plus x over x minus 1 whole squared is equal to 8. We need to find all possible values of x. So, let's start. x squared plus by using this power rule a over b whole to the power n is equal to a to the power n divided by b to the power n. This x over x minus 1 whole squared will become x squared divided by x minus 1 whole squared is equal to 8. Now, we can write the denominator of this x squared 1 and we take LCM of this denominator 1 and this denominator x minus 1 whole squared. The LCM is x minus 1 whole squared. When we divide this LCM x minus 1 whole squared by this 1, we get x minus 1 whole squared. So, we multiply this x squared by this x minus 1 whole squared. x squared multiplied by x minus 1 whole squared and this plus will come here. When we divide this LCM by this uh, denominator x minus 1 whole squared, we get 1 and 1 times this uh, numerator x squared x squared is equal to 8 x x squared times. Now, by using this uh, algebraic identity a minus b whole squared is equal to a squared minus 2ab plus b squared this x minus 1 whole squared will become x squared minus 2 times x plus 1 plus this x squared divided by this x minus 1 whole squared is equal to 8. Now, we multiply this uh, x squared by this expression. x squared times this x squared will become x to the power 4. And this uh, x squared times this negative uh, 2x will become negative 2x cubed. And x squared times plus 1 will become plus x squared. Plus uh, this x squared divided by x minus 1 whole squared is equal to 8. Next, x to the power 4 minus 2x cubed. This uh, 1x squared plus 1x uh, squared will become plus uh, 2x squared divided by x minus 1 whole squared is equal to 8 next x to the power 4 minus from these two terms uh, negative 2x cubed plus uh, 2x squared we can factor out uh, 2x squared and in bracket left uh, x minus 1 divided by x minus 1 whole squared is equal to 8 Now, we can write this expression in partial fractions like this x to the power 4 divided by x minus 1 whole squared minus 2x squared times x minus 1 divided by x minus 1 whole squared is equal to 8. Now, this uh, x to the power 4 over x minus 1 whole squared can be written as x squared divided by x minus 1 whole squared minus this uh, x minus 1 will be cancelled out with this uh, square and this uh, 2 times x squared over x minus 1 can be written as uh, 2 times x squared over x minus 1 is equal to 8. 
Now inside parentheses we have same expression x squared over x minus 1 and here we have same expression x squared over x minus 1. So we suppose that uh, let x squared over x minus 1 is equal to m and we substitute m in this equation then this equation will become m squared minus 2 times m is equal to 8 move this data to the left side then this equation will become m squared minus 2 times m minus 8 is equal to 0. Now this is a quadratic equation and is factorable. We write this m squared m squared and we split this uh, negative 2m as we split this negative 2m as negative 4 times m plus uh, 2 times m minus this 8 is equal to 0. From these two terms uh, m squared minus 4m we can factor out m in bracket left uh, m minus 4. From these two terms uh, we can factor out plus 2 in, in bracket left uh, m minus 4 is equal to 0. Now this expression m minus 4, this expression m minus 4 is a common factor. So we factor out this m minus 4 and in bracket left, in bracket left this m and this plus 2, in bracket left m plus 2 is equal to 0. And from here is this expression m minus 4 is equal to 0 or this expression m plus 2 is equal to 0. From this equation we get the value of m is equal to 4 and from this equation we get the value of m is equal to negative 2. Now to find the values of x recall that we have supposed recall that we have supposed x squared over x minus 1 is equal to m. Recall that uh, we have supposed x squared over x minus 1 is equal to m. First uh, in this equation we put this value of m4 then this equation will become x squared over x minus 1 is equal to 4. And if we multiply both sides by x minus 1, this implies that x squared is equal to 4 times x minus 1. And x squared is equal to 4 times x, 4x and 4 times negative 1, negative 4. We move these two terms to the left side, then this equation will become x squared minus 4 times x plus 4 is equal to 0. Now this uh, quadratic equation is a factorable. We write this uh, x squared x squared and we split this uh, negative 4x as negative 2x minus 2x plus uh, this 4 is equal to 0. From these two terms uh, we can factor out x in bracket left x minus 2 from these two terms uh, we can factor out negative 2 in bracket left x minus 2 is equal to 0. This expression x minus 2 is a common factor in bracket left x minus 2 is equal to 0. And from here either this expression x minus 2 is equal to 0 or this expression x minus 2 is equal to 0. From here x is equal to 2 and from here also x is equal to 2. This is the first value of x, this is the second value of x. So for now we have found two solutions of this equation x1 and x2. Now to find other two solutions, in this equation we put this value of m negative 2 then this equation will become x squared over x minus 1 is equal to negative 2. 
and if we multiply both sides by x minus 1 this implies that x squared is equal to negative 2 times x minus 1 next x squared is equal to negative 2 times x negative 2x negative 2 times negative 1 plus 2 and we move these two terms to the left side then this equation will become x squared plus 2 times x minus 2 is equal to 0. Now this quadratic equation is not factorable so we solve it by quadratic formula. In this equation a is equal to 1, b is equal to 2 and c is equal to negative 2 and according to quadratic formula x is equal to minus value of b 2 plus or minus square root of in place of a b squared we write 2 squared minus 4 times value of a 1 times value of c negative 2 divided by 2 times value of a 1 and x is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of this 2 squared is 4 negative 4 times 1 times negative 2 plus 8 divided by 2 times 1 2 and x is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of 4 plus 8 12 divided by 2 next x is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of this 12 can be written as 4 times 3 divided by 2 next x is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of 4 is 2 times square root of 3 divided by 2 and this 2 1 time this 2 1 time and this 2 1 time so from here we get uh, two values of x x 3 is equal to negative 1 plus uh, square root of 3 and x 4 is equal to negative 1 minus square root of 3 so these are the four solutions of uh, this equation